SpaceX's Starship launch is under FAA investigation after raining potentially hazardous debris on homes and beaches. This is a tale of technology, ambition, and a whole lot of unexpected debris. But don't worry, we've got all the details for you. So buckle up and let's get right into it. And hey, if you like this kind of content, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, share this video with your friends, and hit that subscribe button. Picture this. It's April 20th, 2023. SpaceX's massive Starship and Super Heavy rocket, standing at a whopping 394 feet tall, is about to make history as the largest and most powerful rocket ever built. As it blasts off from Boca Chica, Texas, everything seems to be going according to plan. Until suddenly, it isn't. About four minutes into the flight, the giant rocket explodes in mid-air, leaving behind a trail of dust and debris that rains down on the unsuspecting residents of Port Isabel, Texas, and across Boca Chica's beaches, which just so happen to be nesting grounds for endangered animals like birds and sea turtles. The aftermath of this explosive launch is nothing short of devastating. Port Isabel residents report broken windows, ash-like particles covering their homes and schools, and the launch pad at Boca Chica is left with extensive damage, including charred, twisted metal and shattered concrete. The force from the rocket's engines even blew a hole in the launch pad, creating a crater beneath it. And if that wasn't bad enough, concrete shot out into the ocean, creating shrapnel that risked hitting fuel storage tanks nearby. But that's not all. Unlike other large rocket launch sites, SpaceX's Boca Chica site lacks both a deluge system, which floods pads with shockwave suppressing water or foam, and a flame trench to safely channel burning exhaust away. So what went wrong? And more importantly, who's going to clean up this mess? Enter the Federal Aviation Administration, or FAA, they're the U.S. civil aviation regulator, and they've decided to step in and ground SpaceX's Starship until they've conducted a mishap investigation into what happened during the April 20th test launch. This is standard practice for all mishap investigations, but it still means that SpaceX can't conduct any further launches until the FAA gives them the green light. Now the FAA's investigation will need to conclude that Starship does not affect public safety before it can launch again. As debris spread far further than anticipated, the FAA's Anomaly Response Plan has also come into force, meaning SpaceX must complete extra environmental mitigations before reapplying for its launch license. So it looks like the Starship is grounded for now, but what does this mean for SpaceX's future plans? Despite the unexpectedly messy takeoff and fiery demise of the Starship, SpaceX and Elon Musk have hailed the test as a success, claiming that it enabled engineers to gather essential data for the next launch. In fact, Musk even wrote on Twitter that SpaceX began work on a massive water-cooled steel plate to go under the launch mount three months prior to the launch, but it wasn't ready in time. However, he remains optimistic, stating that the launch could be ready to go again in just one to two months. So, what's next for SpaceX and their groundbreaking Starship? Well, the company has ambitious plans to revolutionize space travel. With Starship's ability to carry 10 times the payload of SpaceX's current Falcon 9 rockets, it's designed to transport crew members, spacecraft, satellites, and cargo to various locations in the solar system. From returning astronauts to the moon to colonizing Mars, the sky's the limit for SpaceX and its Starship. You know, this whole SpaceX Starship saga reminds me of the time I tried to launch my own homemade rocket in my backyard. It wasn't nearly as big or as powerful, but it did leave a pretty big mess to clean up. But hey, we live and learn, right? So there you have it. The captivating story of SpaceX's Starship launch, the FAA investigation, and the potential future of space travel. It's a wild ride, and we'll be sure to keep you updated on all the latest developments as they unfold. In the meantime, let's all hope for a safer and smoother launch next time around. If you enjoyed this video, please give us a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel.